Right now, a family spending day and night searching for a missing 21 year old in the Navy stationed at the Great Lakes Navy base. CBS 2's Jermont Terry live in Waukegan at the bar where Seamus Gray was last seen four days ago. In Jermont, in the last half hour, you got some surveillance video of Gray leaving the bar. Yes, we do, Joe. We're going to show that to you in just a moment. Now, police and investigators tell us that Seamus Gray was last seen in this area early Saturday morning, and but they the video that you're about to see shows him leaving this bar alone. Take a look. Now, this is the video just into our newsroom. It shows Seamus Gray leaving the bar around um, 1.40 Saturday morning. You can see that he is wearing a pink or fuchsia outfit, walking all by himself behind the bar. But here's a better look at Gray, who is a U.S. Navy sailor. Police and family say he left the Naval Station Great Lakes in North Chicago and headed down to Waukegan for a night of St. Patrick's Day celebrations. But Gray never returned turn to the base and now he's missing for what's going on nearly five days. Investigators here in Waukegan are only calling this a missing persons case, but we do know Waukegan police along with Gray's mother spent much of today searching near this bar where he was drinking that night. They also searched along the lakefront with no luck. Now I did talk to Gray's mother who flew into town to help find her son. She saw the surveillance video that you just that we just showed you uh, from the bar but she adds there's also video with someone when someone tried to pickpocket her son and there was an altercation with a group of people gray's mother told me over the phone she fears the worst for her son especially with so many days passing and the fact that he hasn't checked into the naval base and no one has heard from him only worsens her fears again we do know that the family uh, spent much of the day uh, searching um, this area throughout the day and they're going to be back tomorrow morning hopefully looking for any clues into his disappearance. His mother tells me that the Naval Criminal Investigation Service or NCIS is also involved in this investigation. For now reporting in Waukegan, I'm Jermont Terry, CBS 2 News. We'll hope for a break soon, Jermont. Thank you very much.